sad situation down here on 4th Street. CSX, he just struck a vehicle. Here's the front end of it. I can do this discreetly because I don't want to show the victim. Well, there's the front of the car right there. I have the rest of it's on the other side. All right, I can do this discreetly because this is a fatal crash. Yeah, there's debris there. There's debris down here. Yeah, don't show the victim. Hey, is Officer Steve Lamini over there? Yeah, I'm not gonna... Oh, man. Oh, I'm not gonna show that. Oh, you can see the debris everywhere. Let's see. We've got Station 11. DP locomotive right here. Look at that. It's distributed power. I'm down here at the lead locomotive. Just struck that car, rode down here. And here's the lead locomotive that hit that car. So, with that train parked there, it's a similar scenario. So basically, cars would come down, the lights would go off, and people would think the train is parked, and that's how they go around the gate again. I cannot express to you people how important it is to not walk on the tracks or go around those gates. Because if you go around those gates, this is what happens right here. He has less chance to get a picture of it. Oof. Don't run the freaking gates. Brian says, don't run the gates, asshole.
Here's where the car got hit. We got debris field. I say you don't walk on the tracks, you don't run the lights, you just don't do that. Because this is what happens. Well, you get about 150 feet. I'll tell you what, I cannot express to you why you should not run the lights. I mean, this is why you should never run the lights. And always stop, look, and listen. So I say don't walk on the road tracks, don't do anything, don't go near them. As he said, you won't stand on a runway with a plane burn on, so why'd you stand on the railroad trucks? Hi, doggy. See? I mean, this is why you don't run the lights. Stop, look, and listen, and never run the lights, because this is what happens. You get about 150 feet there. I'll see you guys later down here. Have a good night. Should I say have a safe one?